legend lives on from the Chippewa on down of a big lake they call Gitchigumi. Lake it is said never gives up her dead when the skies of November turn gloomy. Load of iron or 26,000 tons more than the Edmund Fitzgerald weighed empty. That good ship and true was a bone to be chewed when the gales of November came early. The ship was the pride of the American side coming back from some mill in Wisconsin. As the big freighters go, it was bigger than most with the crew and good captain well seasoned Concluding some terms with a couple of steel firms When they left fully loaded for Cleveland And later that night when the ship's bells rang Could it be the north wind they've been feeling? wires made a tattletale sound and the way he broke over the railing and every man knew as the captain did too cause the witch of November comes stealing the dawn came late and the breakfast had to wait when the gales of November came slashing when the afternoon came it was freezing rain in the face of a hurricane west wind When supper time came, the old cook came on deck Saying, fellas, it's too rough to feed ya At 7 p.m. a main hatchway came in She said, fellas, it's been good to know ya The captain wired in, he had water coming in And the good ship and crew was in peril And later that night when his lights went out of sight Came the wreck of the Edmund Fitzgerald Does anyone know where the love of God goes When the waves turn the minutes to hours? Searches all say they the made white fish bay if they put fifty more miles behind them. Might have split up or they might have capsized. They may have broke deep and took water. And all that remains is the faces and the names of the wives and the sons and the daughters. Lake Huron Rose Superior sings in the ruins of her ice water mansion. Old Michigan steams like a young man's dreams. The islands and bays are for sportsmen. And farther below Lake Ontario takes in what Lake Erie can send her. And the iron boats go as the mariners all know with the gales of November remember. Old Hall in Detroit, they prayed in the Maritime Sailors Cathedral. The church bell chimed to it rang twenty-nine times for each man on the Edmund Fitzgerald. The legend lives on from the Chippewa on down of a big lake they call Gitchigumi. Superior, they said, never gives up her dead when the gales of November come early.